These are the best defensive coaching adjustments in Madden 25. Real simple video here for you. But I do think that it's helpful just to kind of understand what you have the tools and capabilities of doing with your defense. So the biggest thing here is auto flip defense play call. That is kind of up to you based on your blitz and your defense. But in general, this is going to be on auto alignment. For most people, I would leave this on default. However, if you're running like a dollar set, you can actually put this on base, which is my favorite thing to do when in a lot of my blitzes, such as nickel double mug, dollar three two, those are or dime three two, those are really good. But you can kind of go back and forth based off of really how your how you want your defense to line up. Generally, if you put it on default, you can actually use some covered shells and kind of change your covered shell at the play call screen. But in general, I like to have it either on base or default. Quarterback matchups, do not touch this. Leave this on balance. Option defense, put this on conservative. It is going to focus on the quarterback on the option for, uh, for, for defending that. Strip ball, we're going to leave this on balance. Tackling, we're going to leave this on balance. And our zone drops, we're going to leave all of these on default. This is going to allow us to kind of have the most versatility within our zones. But the one thing I did want to say is if you want to take away corner routes, and I'll show you how this works. If you want to take away corner routes in this game, put your zone drops, put your curl flats on 25 or 30. And I'm going to show you kind of a cool little technique here. I'm actually going to go ahead and show you this out of the out of the uh, dime one four. Doesn't have to be dime one four, but it's really easy to adjust out of cover four here. So we're going to go to cover four drop. What we're going to do is we're going to shade underneath so that those curl flat defenders become hard flats. And then we're going to take the safety on the side we think the corner route's going to be on, and we're going to put him into a purple zone. And of course, I can't. So we need to change a package here. Some, so with some of these formations, sometimes you can't can't do that. So we're just going to go with a – let's see if we can just go cornerback nickel package. That's probably going to solve the problem. And we'll come back out, and we'll show you this corner route. So, again, shade underneath. So you see there. And then we're able to take the safety on the right side. Okay, we can't put him in the zone. So I'll just use this linebacker. So we're just going to put him in a purple zone. That's the basic idea, right? So we're just going to swap these guys. Um, for some reason, this formation has weird adjustments. But anyways – the thing I want you to see is these curl flats this year do a really good job of defending corner routes. So I'm just going to spy my user so that I don't get any sheds here. And you're going to see that that hard flat's going to defend the flat. The deep third's going to defend the streak. And then watch this, watch this curl flat. See how he runs out there super fast and he defends that? That's something that's really, really good in this year's game. Those 25 to 30 yard curl flats for the deeper routes and then those hard flats for the underneath routes to me is the way to go. But these are the best coaching adjustments in Madden 25. Wanted to drop this for you. And if you're looking to take your Madden game to the next level, make sure you join our school community, school.com slash Cody Ballard. That's where you'll get access to all of my Madden 25 offensive and defensive eBooks.